Hey guys, you know, lots of people review movies. I could do a review of a movie like, uh, The Hobbit, The Desolation of Smog. It's not a good movie. It's, a, it's kind of an entertaining movie. You call it a guilty pleasure. All in all, it's kind of a piece of crap. But, that's just my opinion. What no one t seems to talk about are fucking packaging. Packaging is bullshit a lot of times, specifically with DVDs and CDs. Blu-ray has gotten better, but not very much better. So I'm going to show you, I'm going to compare this, The Hobbit The Unexpected Journey's packaging, not the director's cut, which don't buy this. You get a bunch, of, you get dwarf ass in it, in a fountain, and you're like, oh. I'm glad this was cut from the movie, and an alternate beginning that uh, just ruins the pacing. So, Hobbit and Unexpected Journey, with the exception of this fucking cardboard, I don't get why people are like, Ooh, we need to put cardboard on things! And waste trees. You got, you got this cool stuff. I mean, you got the digital download. You got this. This is the Blu-ray. This is the special features for the Blu-ray, and then there's the DVD. Great stuff! Yeah! Works! Works! With the, with the exception of this, which is bullshit, uh, now you see what they did with this. It doesn't really have a jingle like the other one did because of the tray. You open it up. There's the Blu-ray. There's the download. What the? Wait, isn't this supposed to have a bonus features? There's the DVD. Where's the bonus features? Oh, wait! You gotta pull the Blu-ray movie disc out, and here you go! The special features! What the fuck is that? I mean, you got the goddamn movie and you have to put it on top? What if you get confused? What if you, like, you don't notice the, the special features, and you're like, well... And you put them on like backwards, and it's just inconvenient. And what? Oh, and guess what you can do? Ugh, Jesus, son of an ass! It's hard to pull the disc out. I feel like I'm, I'm bending the fucking disc to pull the goddamn thing out. You could put it on here too. You put it on this one, but then you wouldn't have room for the download code. And and what the fuck's up with this? Remember when the like, DVDs used to have like tracking labels? Like you could tell what part of the di the disc to skip to to get close to where you were fast forwarding to when you stopped the movie. And, um, because unfortunately, they don't save those anymore. I don't know. It doesn't make a whole lot of fucking sense. You now, now it's like it's an inconvenience. So fuck it. It's not gonna be on there. Come on. Ugh. Bottom line: don't put one disc on top of the other disc. You put a goddamn tray in and you flip it. Then again, I can't complain. It wasn't that great of a movie. And we'll review this thing at another date. Because it's bulky and unreasonable. Anyway, guys. Have a nice day. I hope you enjoy these videos. Just to break up the, from the, the comic content. I, just, I wanted to bring these videos back. I used to do them, so, you know. Ugh. So many packages. And, ooh, I've just opened your eyes to a whole wide, much larger world of ass. Have a nice day.